nice day to bring your dog to McCovey Cove. The Giants hosting the Rockies, trying to even up their series with their NL West rivals. First inning action here, Barry Zito on the mound for San Francisco, facing Carlos Gonzalez with a man aboard, and Cargo rips one deep to right field. That ball will leave the yard and then bounces into the Cove. Third straight game with a home run for Gonzalez. It's 2-0 Rockies. In the fourth inning, it's a 3-0 Colorado lead. Jordan Pacheco at the plate. He'll single at the center field. That scores Michael Kadire, and the Rockies have a 4-0 advantage. Bottom six, the Giants trying to claw their way back into it. Man on second for Hunter Pence. He'll drive one into the right field corner for an RBI double. That scores Buster Posey. It's a 4-1 game. Juan Nicasio pulled after that, and the Giants score two more times in the inning to make it 4-3. Bottom seven, two on one out for Andres Torres, and he'll rip one down the line off of Rex Brothers. That's an RBI double. Buster Posey comes in to score once again, and we are all tied at four. The next batter is Brandon Crawford, up with men on second and third. He'll bounce one to second base. DJ LeMayhew comes home with it, and Brandon Belt is called out at the plate. He appeared to get the foot in before the tag was applied by your Vitor Alba, but home plate up Alfonso Marquez calls him out. Bottom eight, one on one out for Pablo Sandoval. He'll sky one into shallow left center field, and it dunks in for a base hit. Marco Scudero trying to take the extra base, headed for third, and the throw from Carlos Gonzalez is in time. Or was it? Alfonso Marquez covering third base on the play. He calls Scudero out, even though the tag from Nolan Arenado was never applied. Bruce Bochy comes out to argue the play. He is promptly ejected from the game, and the Giants do not score in the inning. This game would go to extra innings, still tied at four. And in the top half of the 10th, Troy Tulowitzki, the Santa Clara, California native, goes deep to left off Sergio Romo for a solo shot, his 10th of the year, 5-4 Colorado. But in the bottom half of the inning, there's a man on second with one out for Angel Pagan, facing Rockies closer Rafael Bedencourt. Here's KNBR with the call. Pagan swings and it's a high drag to right field and deep. This one is hit really well. It is off the bottom of the wall center field. Crawford coming around third. He'll score. Pagan coming to third. And Flannery's going to send him. Here comes the relay. Pagan slides. He's safe. It's an inside the park home run. And the Giants win it 6-5. to five. My goodness. Pagan records Major League Baseball's first walk-off inside the park home run since Ray Sanchez did it for Tampa Bay back in 2004. It's the third career inside the parker for Pagan and his second career walk-off home run. Sergio Romo serves up the home run to Tulowitzki in the 10th but still gets the win. Rafael Betancourt takes the loss as the Giants snap a four-game losing streak against Colorado.